Good evening. As you can see, uh, the sky over London is getting darker, but uh, what I'm going to say to you today is possibly the brightest business advice uh, you can get. Uh, it's, it's definitely the brightest business advice I ever got. Now, uh, I'm often asked, Sam, what is the best business advice you could give to, to someone starting a business? What is one thing that you think that uh, any entrepreneur, any startup founder, uh, any wannabe out there who wants to make a success out of his life uh, absolutely positively needs to know? And uh, I say one word, FANAFI, which is short for uh, find a need and fill it. Now, you might already heard that one, it's a really old advice, but it's really important, so I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, repeat it once more. Find a need and fill it. Now, this may sound uh, overly simplistic, it may sound, uh, you know, rudimentary, it may sound uh, obvious, but uh, it, it really is the essence of all the wealth that was created during the past century and is the essence of all the wealth that is being created right now in this great city of London and worldwide. Someone found the need and someone filled the need and in the process he or she made a lot of money. Now uh, take a look at any captain of industry uh, anywhere in the world. Uh, Henry Ford, uh, Sam Walton, Steve Jobs, people like that, okay? They all found the need and fill it. And by doing it so, they helped uh, people. They, 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 they bettered people's lives. They, they made a world a better place, as they like to say. Now, uh, what did Henry Ford do? He made uh, cars accessible to the common man, right? Before him, everyone... Uh, who bought a car had to be rich. Henry Ford came, uh, he made them cheaper. Now anyone can have a car, right? Uh, uh, Sam Walton, he, he sold stuff for cheaper and by doing it so raised the standard of living because uh, stuff costed less, right? Uh, Steve Jobs, he, 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 he made uh, possible for everyone to communicate with everyone over the internet, over the iPhone, and uh, you know he made it easy, so you don't have to be a, a, a rocket scientist to figure it out, right? You didn't have to be an IT geek; you could be just you know an average granny, and you can see your grandchild on or on FaceTime or whatever. So uh, all of these people find the need, uh, found the need, and fill it. And by doing it so, they, they change people's lives for better. They, they, you know, and as they like to say in the startup community, they make the world a better place. Now, that sounds like a cliche, but when you find a need, you feel that need, you're actually making a world a better place because you're helping people, you're solving their problems. Everywhere you go, everywhere you look, there are opportunities to improve something, to make something better, to uh, make something simpler, cheaper, or more expensive, you know, uh, if this is what people want. Uh, so all you have to do is put a little entrepreneurial hat and uh, look the world around you with, with the eyes of the entrepreneur. This would be a song like Eyes of the Tiger, Eyes of the Entrepreneur. And uh, once you look the world with the eyes of entrepreneur, you will see uh, problems that needs to be solved. You will see uh, customer complaints that go unanswered. You, you, you will see uh, things that you can make better. You will see uh, needs that needs to be filled or wants that needs to be satisfied. And uh, so all you gotta do is uh, Find the need and fill it. And by doing so, you will make people's life better. And by 
by by making people lives better you will make this world a better place as as cliche as it might seem so um you know go out there and fight something that uh find a need that you can fulfill and when you do so you will make um your dreams come true see you at the top